the, the right word. They were vacuum sealed. And then rimmed pretty much. Rimmed. So let's open them up. See if they still taste as good as they did back then. They are Publix chocolate chip cookies. They're kind of like the soft, chewy kind. So let's get them open. Sounds like it's just in time. Woo! I heard that seal. What are we doing? Man, you can't have cookies without milk. Man enough. Are you? I don't even want to go there. Alright, so since Ed's here, we're gonna let him try one first. Kinda, what are you reading it for? Kinda hard and stale. So. Really? Ooh, they smell good. Smell them. You smell them? Smells like cantaloupe. No, they don't. She was eating cantaloupe in here earlier. I was the eating the batik samara melon. Yeah. Oh, you got that with the sugar on so, it in there. So this this I'm not really You're big. He's scared. No, I'm not real big into chocolate to be honest, and chocolate chip just ain't one of my favorite cookies, but um so it does smell like chocolate. Um it's not all soft, so it, it didn't get uh you know, it didn't get soft, and didn't it's, get it's, stale. Not, it's not crumbly. Mmm. It, it has the same texture as it did before. Yeah. I would say that uh, even after of being canned up, I don't know if you could read that or not. Mmm. 9, 20 of 19. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's, they're still good cookies. Mmm. Of course, Need a glass of milk. I mean, cookies and milk, that's just... Not almond milk. No, milk. Milk, milk. Well, there you go. Vacuum seal. Preserves the freshness. Now, it's really simple. Uh, this is what it, it looks like if I wasn't using it. Um, for the space savers but I'm gonna make sure that it's closed because you know and even though it comes with its own little hose you see the difference in uh, the size so I want to make sure that oh, you can tell I didn't dust uh, and I'm not going to <laughs> let's keep it real all right um, because these are two different sizes, you want to make sure you use the one that came with your con um, container, <laughs> your device. Alright, so this is the wide mouth and the cookies and oatmeal, actually, I put in wide mouths because they fit. But because the jar I'm going to use to show you is actually a reused one. See this? Remember that? This is the one that it took a drink of. <laughs> so we're just going to use that one real quick. And because that's the smaller one, we're going to use a regular mouth. All right. So I put one end in the hole there. And then I put the other end in this little attachment here. Make sure this is on. Doesn't have to be poppy, it doesn't matter. And now that it's tight, then I'm going to push my vacuum button. actually tells me that it's ready, that the air has been sucked out. I'm going to go ahead and leave it because sometimes it will actually turn off on its own. Sometimes it won't and I'll have to turn it off. Let's see if it worked. Pull that out. Let the air out. 
Yeah. <laughs> Just kind of wiggle it off. If it didn't work that time, looks like it worked. Looks like it worked. It's that easy.